Hello guys, in this video I want to show you guys how to print from your smartphone, Android smartphone. So here, let's go ahead and I already did a video with using it on a tablet. So now I want to show you guys how it works on the phone. Um, here, when you load it up and you set it up, you automatically have to set it up. If you want to see how to set it up, just go ahead and watch my tablet. Uh, my other video that I did before, I'll, I'll make a link to this video and that way you can see how you can you, um, set up any printer. This works on any printer, Canon, HP, no matter what printer as long as it's wireless. And here, the cool thing about this, um, the phone app for this, it's the same phone, it's the same app. So if you buy the app once, you can use it on both. But on the phone, you will have a couple features that you will not have on the tablet version um, here you got messages so right here you could go ahead and, and go and print mm, your text messages let's go ahead and say I want to print um, this uh, uh, text messaging from my wife let's go ahead and print um, print and here you're gonna have a cop um, all the conversation with that person so let's say I want to choose both pages let's just say I want to choose only one let's choose one for the purpose of this video um, here also you got options for your paper size here make sure your paper is set to um, letter because uh, if you enter 4 by 6 like I did before it will print at 4 by 6 on a, on the letter page so right now it's set there normally so here I'm gonna choose to print it tells me how many copies and let's go and print the app so um, this app works perfectly I've been trying it on the tablet and it's a uh, beauty and it works very good with um, um, Dropbox it works very good with Google Docs and here it is now I got print out all the text messaging between me and my wife. You can also, here it has a call log. You can also record, um, print, let's say in the past 10 days I want to print for legal purposes, purposes, I want to print all the calls that I did and received. So here it will let you print all that. It, it printed a page of all the call logs. Um, make calls and received calls that's very cool these are two features that are not available when you're using a tablet that's pretty weird the way it recognizes it's a tablet um, so here it has the same features you could print from message, uh, messages you could print from email um, very this is a very cool feature that I loved um, here you go choose your email and you could go ahead and print um, whatever document uh, whatever email you have boom and I choose print and that's it it'll print from my email which is very nice let's go back let me show you guys what else can you do here you can print your files if you got files in any folder like myself I'd say I have files in my download folders most of the times uh, let me see Let's go to download. I got some pictures and I got some zip files. I can't print those, but I, I can print pictures. Okay, let's go ahead and print from Google Docs. No, let's go ahead and print uh, Google Docs. If you go to Google Docs, your account is in it already. You go right here and choose any document. Like I said, it works on Word, it works on PDF, it works on um, Excel. So let's go ahead and choose that CPA uh, resume builder. Uh, these are three pages. I'm not going to record all three pages, but let's go ahead and choose only one. And here, like I said, you could control the letter type and everything, the color if you want it black and white. Here, let's go ahead and print, select, and that's it. I'm printing from Google Docs, which works flawlessly. Let's see. Yep, that's right, that's correct. Nice. So I printed my resume. I printed my purchase from my email. Let's say you're using your Dropbox account. And here from your Dropbox account, I want to print a document. 
So let's go and choose a, let me see, let me choose this time. I'm gonna choose an Excel document. So here, let's go and choose time cards. I got lots of documents. Let's go and choose that. It's gonna tell me which app do I wanna open it with. So here we're gonna choose print hand. When you choose print, automatically it's gonna send it to your app. Here, let's say there's two pages. So let's go ahead and print this one because this is the one that I want. And here we choose print and we choose print right now and I'm printing from Dropbox so now let's say I, I want to print a photo from my gallery um, here when you choose on um, gallery it's gonna search all the folders in your phone so let's say I want to choose this photo this folder automatically is gonna show you all the photos in that folder let's go ahead and choose this photo and let's go ahead and choose print here like you can see it's in a big page with a little photo. Here you can go ahead and change the picture size of the document. Let's go ahead and choose that. Um, let's choose no margins. And here you, you gotta choose on the on the here, you gotta choose four by six. Four by six. Let's see how it looks now. You can see how the photo looks right there very nice so on your printer of course let's go ahead and let's go ahead and get my printer ready mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. let's go there and try to change that so let's go I, I'm already getting a warning my ink is low so if my ink if the picture comes out not looking that good so it's my ink <laughs> so let's go ahead here and then choose print let's choose selected and now it should print my photo it's going to take a while because it's a photo so now it's printing the photo and the printer the colors might look ugly because I already got a warning that my printer was bad look at that <laughs> it came out it did print but my ink is low so that's why it didn't print perfectly okay but like you can see you can print pictures from your from your using your phone and using the app so it works perfectly just make sure you have ink <laughs> and that's it guys I'm gonna tell you guys this app works flawlessly very nice very awesome and this app is only $4.99 in the App Store and once you buy it once it will work on your tablet and on your phone and so on so on so guys I hope you guys like the video and enjoy this tutorial um, if you have any questions go ahead and ask and till next time